How good does it feel to be back out here and getting ready for this final 25? Uh, it feels good. I mean, just been uh, just, just ready to get back out here um, and play games that actually count. But uh, the break was the break was definitely great. It was definitely good for us. Coming out of it, you draw a tough uh, competition in Golden State. How much different do they look with uh, with Marcus there? Uh, I mean, that gives them another guy that's extremely versatile, can do everything on the floor. Um, just another weapon uh, that they have, but uh, we go out there and we, we, we still going to play our game. I mean, we know that it's going to be a tougher matchup, but it is what it is. Last time you played some so crazy, uh, all those threes made from the NBA record. Uh, coach talked about pushing the pace again tomorrow. You know they want to run. You expect more of the same? Uh, I don't know. I mean, uh, that's just how that game turned out. Um, you know, you're not going in thinking that, you know, so many threes are going to be shot, so many things are going to be made. Both teams got hot and uh, kept shooting them, so uh, I'm not going out expecting the same game as last time. Do you relish this challenge? I mean, obviously this is... That's another game. It's just another game again? Yeah. Why wouldn't it be? Stop them from taking the season sweep. Obviously, the first game, the second half, set his tone. Uh... Yeah. Kind of along those lines, when you think of the 25 that are in front of you guys, and obviously it's tough sledding to close out this month. Just how do you kind of look at the challenge that's ahead of you for Oh, with us, we just got to stay focused. You know, uh, like it's been said, um, you know, Sacramento hasn't played, you know, too many games after the break that, that actually means something for ourselves. Uh, instead of playing spoiler, you know, we're actually trying to get in the playoffs. So uh, we just got to be able to keep our composure, go through every game knowing that um, yeah, no, no game is more important than the next. But all of them, you know, are equally important. And we have to come out there focused and just being able to execute as a young team. With the Warriors, I mean, I know so much has been said about the way you guys have played them this year. And even going back to last year, you guys split the season series. How much did that, those games last year kind of give you guys some confidence coming into this season against a team like that? I mean, just coming in knowing that, I mean, you can compete and, and beat anybody. Um, you know, we lost a few of those that we probably shouldn't have lost. Uh, you know, we had good leads and uh, just came down to, to end of game execution. And... Um, I mean, just going in, you know, that's that's what we know we need. Uh, we know that we can play with them, but, you know, sometimes it just comes down to the fourth quarter or the last, you know, five minutes of a game. How about you guys want this, given how the last three games panned out? I mean, 10 points combined and being able to get this win against? Uh, definitely coming out, I mean, trying to win. You know, um, I mean, it's happened against a few teams. Uh, I mean, Portland being one that, you know, we dropped one that we should have won. But uh, came back, fixed what we needed to fix, and we ended up winning the next game. So uh, this is just one of those type of games. You look at the way that you finished last season and the way that you guys kept fighting the whole way. Do you think that helped you guys a little bit? I mean, now you're not just playing, you know, to be a spoiler, but you had a, a feel for what the full 82 was like. Uh, definitely, definitely. I mean, like you said, last year was more so spoiler. We had, uh, I think, San Antonio needed to beat us uh, to get in the playoffs, and they, they executed. They did what they needed to do, and they won the game. So... Um, I mean, now going into it, we kind of know what that feels like. And um, but, I mean, it's not one game left. You know, it's 25. So uh, we just got to go out there, play our game, and uh, we'll live with the results. Is there one thing about Charlotte and the All Star trip that like people don't realize? I guess when they, when they know what kind of everything that kind of goes into that. Uh, I mean, just how much just how much players are are, are doing out there. You know, guys running around. Um, you know, you got media here, there, there. Um, it's just a lot of events going down. Uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's a break for guys, but I mean, it, it's not too much of a break. You know, you, you still have a lot to do. You still are asked a lot of if you're including that weekend. How much, how much rest, actual rest did you get? Uh, well, I left Sunday morning, so I got like two days. Coming out of the break, having that little bit of rest and then refocusing at what is ahead of you, do you sense a building excitement amongst this group? Oh, definitely, definitely. I mean, everybody was ready to get back on the floor. Uh, la uh, yesterday, we got back on the court. Um, you just kind of felt like everybody was ready to play basketball again. And I um, mean, guys have definitely worked out, uh, but it's not the same, you know, once you once the team gets back together, then you, you really feel the excitement. I know you had a couple of practices uh, with the players who just got right before uh, the All-Star break. The coach talked about the fact that it's going to take time for that full acclimation. Is, is there a rush on that because of the urgency of the situation? Um, I mean, I wouldn't say there's a rush, uh, kind of easing them to it, but I mean, they're learning what they can learn. Uh, you know, we're not throwing, you know, the whole thing at them, but um, we got We just got to go out there and execute what we're running, you know. Uh, but other than that, I mean, you end up drawing stuff on the board, and uh, they're kind of getting acclimated to how we play, not necessarily the plays, because a lot of times it's not about the plays that we're running; it's about you know how we're running. And um, I mean, they're getting pretty used to that.